One thing I've noticed since I've tuned the car is that my cold start is deleted, so it's not as loud anymore. And I kind of miss how loud my cold start used to be. Let's see how rough the start is going to be with the E85. Oh, not bad. Look how quiet it is. Like, that's crazy before. Why did we just stall? I was just about to mention I don't like how it starts without the cold start because it feels like it's gonna die out and it literally just literally did what I feared. It literally just went right died. That's crazy. So my cold starts before used to be stupid loud. They used to be like now it doesn't do that. So as you just heard now it's just like it's crazy. So this video, eh, actually let me just get to the shop first then I'll tell you. All right guys, so we're at Best Service Auto Body. This is the spoiler that I bought. I'll leave a link for it in the description down below. It was like 60 bucks. I really like the upkick style. It's kind of like a CSL trunk spoiler thingy. Um, I really like how it looks. And what we're gonna do is, I know a lot of you, I saw this on Instagram already when I posted it. A lot of you actually liked how it looked on the car just like this and told me like, I don't even need to paint it. But I actually just wanna paint match it. So that's why I brought it to Best Service Auto Body. Um, we're not just only gonna use this, it was cheap. So they only gave you like 3M tape. But we're not just gonna only use this to adhere this onto the trunk. We'll show you guys later that. So it, you know, holds on tighter. But I'm gonna show you guys how it looks without it so you guys can get a look of how it'll look on the car once it's on. The fitment isn't bad, but again, remember, we only paid 60 bucks for it. So there's an idea of how it'll look. It looks really good in my opinion. I feel like it suits the car very well. Um, I like how it kicks up. Yeah, I think it looks really good. I like how it kicks up and I think it flows with the car extremely well. So, I mean, honestly, for the price that I paid for it, it's not bad. The quality, to me, I can't tell, but the guys at the shop said it's, it's really not that great, but it can work, so it is what it is. Like I said, I'll leave a link down below in the description if you guys are interested in buying this. For these, those of you that have BRZs as well, it's not that expensive and it's gonna look sick. So let me get some before and after shots for you guys and then uh, we can start with the painting process. amazing um i literally i wish the camera would show it i feel like the camera's not showing i can't tell because of the screen on my camera i can't tell if it's like showing how it is in person but this looks literally amazing like best service auto body killed it on this um <laughs> like it looks so good like it just i can't believe like what this was like a couple hours ago and what it looks like now like the gloss the shininess like it's just amazing and then seeing the pearl in the white like i don't know if you guys can see that let me try to zoom in on it this looks crazy all in all, so. So this has been in here for the past like 40 minutes now. He put a second coat of clear on it, by the way. So um, after he put that second coat of clear, it's been about like 40 minutes or so. And uh, yeah, so that'll pretty much do it for today's video. I guess I'll make a, the next video will be putting this onto the BRZ, which will probably be a funner video for you guys. But um, today's video was basically us painting it and getting it prepped for paint and how we match it and how they do it at Best Service Auto Body, just so you guys can see for some of you that Always hit me up from time to time asking me, oh, like, where can I go for body work? Who do you go to? I feel like it's like I say it so often, but some people still don't know. Like, I literally only go to Best Service Auto Body to do my, my, my body work to any of my cars. When I had my F30, my M Sport kit was painted by yours truly, Best Service Auto Body, the whole kit, front bumper, back bumper, side skirts. So it's only right to do the same for the BRZ. So this came out great. Now it's going to sit in the booth for like 24 hours or so. 
I mean, obviously longer than that until I have a next day also I can come to the shop and we can do the install video. But that pretty much does for this video, guys. Huge, 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 huge shout out to Best Service Auto Body for killing it on this. I swear it looks amazing. I'm gonna try to get you guys some stills, some before and afters. You can check it out right here, how it looked right before we put the clear coat on. And then you can see it right here, how it looks with the clear coat after. So literally it's, it's like night and day difference. It's crazy how much the gloss makes such a big difference or the clear coat, sorry. But yeah, technically it is gloss. But anyway guys, that pretty much does it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Take care, peace out.